All right, when you came, when you came from just now? Yeah. Keep me down to talk to him about it. And <coughs> He found you sitting in the hallway and just asked you, hey, what's going on? I asked him if he had a minute and I talked to him. Yeah. And he got up and raised his voice and I'm like, please step back and get out of my face. And he wouldn't, he's like, no, I won't. And I, uh, I we'll, we'll get him in here and he can talk. No, about I don't want him in here. I'll make a police report. Okay. You know what? That, then your mom is going to talk to Mr. G alone because you need both sides of the story before you react. Okay. Look at this, Mr. Strauss. Look at this. This is not a kid that's going to make up something. Mm. Vinny came up to him. Yeah. Vinny yeah. came up to him and told him. Caleb just told me that he was walking up to Vinny and asked Vinny why people are still saying stuff. And Vinny apologized to him for his role in it. That's what I heard from Caleb <coughs> just now. Okay. Well, whatever the conversation was, I'm too furious to even. That's, All I know, know that is, the is that the principal shoved his chest up against Caleb. He did not his shove face. his chest up against Caleb. Were you there? I okay. It. Were you there? We, we can. Now you weren't there either. So no, I'm just, just saying. So, and we can have Mr. G talk with you, and he can tell you what's going on. He can't even talk to me about calling back with a kid that has an issue. Mr. G has not talked to me since I had an issue with him. So now he wants this. to talk to me. No, you're just saying that you only really know. I am saying that Mr. G can come in and talk to you about this. Okay, well, we need to. He, we need to get this figured out I before. I um, go to Mr. Strauss. He's not going to deal with it. And then I said, uh, he said we were tight and that, you know, he would help me out. And I. How did he come up to things. you with his chest? No, he stood up and. It was like, get up right now. I was like, please, can you step back? Because he was just right, his legs right in my face, and he would not move. So I stood up, you know, to go, and I was like, can I just, can I, I can walk by myself, I know. And then he got up, and he stepped, like, stiffened his chest, and I did this, you know, to like, get off of me, and he kept walking forward and stuff. And then I was by the door in the corner, and he just kept walking towards me. I was like, please, man, I can just go by myself. I, I just... I recorded all of it. I don't. I don't need it to talk to anybody. Where's he at? I want to speak to him. Okay. Make that happen. I'll be right back.